Hi, this is Corbin Blue, and you're watching FR Conventions. Something you would like to say to Moni Coleman. Uh, I would like to say happy birthday because today is her birthday and I love you so much. You are one of my favorite people on this planet uh, and I'm just so grateful to tell you. All right. Describe in three words. Zac Efron, uh, I would say talented, missed, and ripped. Your funniest anecdote with Ashley Tisdale. Uh, so I think one of the funniest things is Ashley and I realized like a few weeks after having worked together on the first movie that we knew each other. So Ashley's mom came out and said, I just realized I have pictures of you two together as kids, like little kids from when you were modeling back in New York, uh, which is really, really true and cool. We've got like just pictures as, as little kids together because uh, we, and we, we didn't even realize it until, until a few weeks in. Okay. Your best scene with Lucas Graviel. That's an easy one. I don't dance, absolutely. One of my favorite scenes too. Your best memory on set with Kenny Ortega. Oh, there are so many good ones. Uh, I would have to say my favorite memories were from the rehearsal room. Uh, we had a great time on set, all the time, of course, but I feel like it was in the rehearsal room that we always got those lessons, those incredible life lessons, those incredible work lessons uh, from Kenny, and just his, his nuggets of wisdom that he would constantly bestow upon us. Um, probably the day that he also created the iconic roller coaster movement in the second movie. Your first thoughts on Vanessa Hudgens. Uh, my first thoughts on Vanessa. So the very first time we met, uh, we ended up just hanging out, me, her, Zach and uh, we went swimming that evening. Uh, and I just remember thinking that they were both so cool. I was like the younger of everybody. I'm, I'm, I'm the baby out of the group. Uh, and I always felt like a little bit more awkward or uncool and I just thought they were just really, really cool. <laughs> the best quality of Casey Stroh. Casey is innovative. I think that, uh, I mean, Casey's many, many things. She's extremely talented. She's a wonderful dancer. She's an incredible wife and mom, um, and so, so kind and giving and thoughtful. Uh, but I do think that she is so innovative. I, I, I really just love what she has uh, done with her career and, and what she continues to, to produce on a daily basis. What you miss the most about Alicia Ruin. Oh, Alicia. Uh, I, Alicia is such a kind and special person. Uh, and she also just had a baby and she is like such the quintessential, like, Instagram worthy image of what a mom would and should be. Um, I think that she, what I miss the most about her, um, just her energy. Truly, being, a, being around Alicia, you, you just always feel good. 
your first meeting with Allison Reed. I can't remember the very, very first meeting. It's, it's, hard, it's hard to remember the first time I met Allison. Um, but we developed such a special relationship over the course of the films because Chad and Miss Darvis have such a special relationship. Um, but yeah, Allison, she, I mean, not only is, is an icon herself and just what she's, her, her own body of work prior to High School Musical and, and being such a, a fan of musicals myself and, and, and knowing her from that, uh, I, I was very um, excited to work with her. But uh, I think that over, over the course of, of the three films, we, we just found little moments here and there to, to continue to make that Chad and Miss Darvish relationship thrive.